Breeders' Cup Phillies and Mare Sprint next. And um, guess what? We're down to five this time. So three in the first, six in the second, five in the third. Do we really need a Phillies sprint? Just have one sprint and be done with it. Fader and Odalorni for Padre Gogan. Dante Algieri, Paul Rhodes, Gilda Leon, Dan Hughes, Stormfront, Joshua Sutherland, and White Poppy for John Morgan. So five horses this time, and away we go. At least we've got a couple of new trainers joining in, and it's Stormfront and Fader and Odalorni for those two trainers who've yet to have had a runner in the day's races. So we now have nine trainers involved in the first three races. Uh, White Poppy's in the lead from Fader and Odalorni in second. Gilda Leon is third. And then Dante Algieri and Stormfront. As they take this turn on the bottom end of the track. I'm sure these races are supposed to be really exciting. They're supposed to be sort of almost end of season championship races with big fields that are Big-ish fields, for the, as big as you can cope with on the all. I think you've got to be looking at least a dozen. And why are we only getting five runners? Fader and Odalorni in the lead. On White Poppy second, Gilda Leon, and then Dante Algeri in storm front as they race down to the final final and a half. I think the all with the finals are also pretty sparsely populated tomorrow as well. So. Fader and Odalorni now being challenged by White Poppy and White Poppy's going to swoop to take it I think White Poppy is going to win it pretty comfortably I mean White Poppy wins the Breeders' Cup Sprint for John Morgan and Favourite takes it White Poppy, John Morgan the winner Fader and Odalorni, Padraig Hogan the second Gilda Leon, Dan Hughes, third, Stormfront, Paul, uh, Joshua Sutherland, fourth, and Dante Algieri for Paul Rhodes was fifth. <laughs>